guys it's me the big b um a video this time on the playstation 3 uh, jailbreak believe it or not before you could jailbreak but uh, well not jailbreak you could hack it using a, a dongle you had to buy a uh, ps groove and all them sort of businesses and they were quite expensive but geohot who jail jailbroke the iphone and ipod devices has now jailbroken the PlayStation 3. The only requisite is it has to be on official 3.55 firmware and then you can download basically another, it's like an update file as if you were going to update your PlayStation 3 via USB and you put it on just the same, it's only about a 4.6 megabyte file and what that does is then that jailbreaks your PlayStation 3 that allows then unassigned code to run or it, it well not unassigned code that's wrong it's signed but he's released the tools to be for you to be able to sign your own um, your own packages which will allow homebrew to run it does not allow backup loader and things to run at the minute you kind of use it for piracy but that's a little bit like um, when the Wii first came out you had the homebrew channel the homebrew channel put a warning up every time he installed it that it was not intended for pirating but then obviously people were then able to write loaders and that to take advantage and that's what will happen here it's now jailbreakable on that firmware um, you can then run uh, PK, I think it's PKG files or whatever as long as they signed which is giving you the software for your PC uh, whatever to actually sign them yourself if you know what you're doing but it won't be long before someone obviously releases a, a, a loader, some sort of loader, a little bit like the way you can already do it using the other technique with the with the dongle you have to buy and use the the loader. But this is a, a much easier technique. You don't need a special dongle you have to buy. You just stick this update on a normal memory stick, stick it in as long as you are on genuine, untouched 3.55 firmware. So this is good news, guys. This means um Again, for people who are not too much worried about piracy, emulators, all your emulators will run. Um, third party games, things like that, proper homebrew, which will be really, really cool without any messing about. And like I said, within a couple of weeks, I can almost guarantee there'll be some sort of backup loader um, released for this thing, which will be really cool. So listen guys, don't update your firmware past 3.55 because it probably will be blocked at that point um, Geohot has already said that even when it's updated it still won't stop the jailbreak apparently um, whether you then you have to re-jailbreak obviously I don't know or whether he'll have to launch, like release another jailbreak for that firmware but what he said is unofficially that the only way Sony can stop the jailbreak considering he, he found and unlocked all the keys was to physically change the hardware which is not going to happen anytime soon it's not like they're going to all of a sudden release the playstation 4 to try and counteract this problem it'd be too expensive to do so for the the foreseeable future it looks like it's hacked packed and cracked it, it's done he's geo hot's done it again the only thing i would say guys on YouTube is obviously you're going to get a lot of these fake videos start popping up saying get the jailbreak here and it's going to be linking to them stupid survey sites fill your server in you don't need it you can go to PS Groove website and download it for free which I have done I've just downloaded the whole thing um, and geohot.com they've he's released obviously the the sign and package the thing to sign code and things so it'll run is uh, is being released on his his website so it's all freely downloadable guys you don't have to do all these con surveys you don't have to pay for it it's totally free of charge just go and look for it like you say pierce groove website and if you just do a, a google search you'll find it it's there i've got it and what does annoy us is we will get a, a um absolute ton of these fake videos don't click on them guys you don't need to you don't need to feed their pockets by clicking on their survey sites so it's good news I'm going to keep sort of a close eye on this um, because I've got it all on Twitter I've, I've got quite a lot of these guys on Twitter so I can see exactly what's going on and um, but it's good news
good news for the homebrew guys if you're into pirate and it's going to be pretty good news for that as well or if you're just into one like what some people have said it's going to be great for those people who, who don't want to use the dvd drive because they do knack up um, and you'll be able to run your games pretty bit, bit, bit like what you do on the xbox 360 now where you can install games to hard drive you've got to still have the original disc in but it just is in there for just because it needs to check you've got the original game where this you won't need the disc in but it's a similar sort of thing and it will save a lot of wear and tear on your on your blu-ray drive believe me so good news guys i'll keep you informed um like i say go and get the files the files are there you can jailbreak it as long as you're on the right firmware you can jailbreak it in two seconds it's that quick uh, a lot of people have been you know jailbreaking them already as soon as it's come out and it, it takes seconds guys normal 32 bit uh, 32 bit um normal uh, not ntsfc file system i think it's going to be a uh, fat 32 was the word i was looking for um formatted as you would in a normal playstation and you stick the, all you're going to get is the, the the pub file what's called the pup file you've got to put it in a couple of folders which i can't remember what they are now i think it's a um, ps3 update folder then another folder inside that called update then the file inside that but just just google that because i'm not quite sure because it's been a long time since i've done one but it's as simple as that stick it in go to the update firmware tell it you're doing it from memory stick bang done job done so good luck with it guys um hopefully everyone will soon um have it on board and we'll be able to get some serious homebrew going so we'll catch you next time guys